hand on that ball, and the ball is stolen on the inbounds. Quick timeout taken, the last one for the Tigers of Tennessee State. The thing you always talk about is you've got to get the ball in bounds. They doubled Cannon, he busted through it, and they just didn't make a good pass to him. Patrick Miller, who makes up for the turnover, and he steals one. Oh, let's see what they come up with. Oh, geez. Covington has it. And they have to touch him right away. That's Ivan Aska. You think? So Covington's game has been overshadowed a little bit by Cannon. And he Do something with it. The racers have timeouts. Just them both. Covington could not knock him down. Daniel will bring it up here. Cannon almost gets fouled. Ball scrambled on the floor. We got a foul coming up. And they say it's a Murray State foul on Jawan Long. I not understand why. They're calling it on Cannon. He's just going for a loose ball. That's all that is, especially in this situation. Whoa. And then throw it. Daniel will fire the inbound. A baseball pass deep. And it's too far out of bounds. Tennessee State has the basketball. The Tigers are ready to rack up a tremendous victory after the free throw miss. And Murray State's perfect season is stopped at 23 games by the Tennessee State Tigers who do it on the road here in Murray, Kentucky. Unbelievable effort defensively. Isaiah Cannon tried to do it all by himself, but that's going to be one happy bus ride for the Tennessee State Tigers. Steve Brom congratulating the Tennessee State Tigers. Steve never knew how long the run would go, and it stops at 23 wins. And the last...